What's up, YouTube? It's Eddie from Double E Baby. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to customize your home screen with the new iOS 14 update and make your apps any photo or icon you want it to be. First step that we're going to want to do is pick our background and color palette. You can pick any style you want, whatever you feel like is really up to preference. So I know I wanted a Dragon Ball Z theme set up. So I just went ahead and typed in Dragon Ball Z aesthetic and I found a few different ones. They're all kind of dope. Um, I was scrolling down and I saw this one, kind of liked it. So all you're going to have to do is just download it. And after you download it, you go over to your finder. Scroll up and find where it downloaded at. And mine was right here. So all you have to do, hit share and I'm airdrop it to myself. Next step that you're going to want to take is you're going to want to remove everything from your home screen to the second page or your last page of your phone. So to move all your apps is pretty simple. All you're gonna wanna do is hold down on your apps and then you're just gonna drag and drop onto your next page. And you're gonna to continue to do this until you move all your apps onto that second page. Now that we moved all our apps to our last page, the next step that we can do is create our photos slash icons for the apps. So we're gonna to have to resize the photos that we had downloaded or airdropped to ourselves from the internet. And the app I like to use is called Over. So if we download through the app and look through it, we'll go to images and then we just click on the images that we found and you're going to change it to 1.1 as the size ratio. Now after we do the first one, you just continue to do that to all your apps that you want to be on your page. The next step we're gonna to need to do is make shortcuts for all our apps. So we're gonna to wanna to swipe over and type in shortcuts. And once we get inside of shortcuts, you're gonna hit the plus button and it's gonna pop up new shortcuts and click on add action. And then you're gonna to go to the search bar and type in open app. And then you're gonna click the one right here and then you're gonna click on the three dots. And then you can pick any app you want, just scroll through and look through. And I'm going to just pick TikTok and then you're going to click on it and then you're going to type in a shortcut name. And then after that, you're going to click on add home screen and you're going to have to retype it again. So type in TikTok. And once you're done with that, you can click on the icon and then you can choose your photo. I'm going to click this one and then you're going to click on add and then click done. And if you back out, it's probably going to end up on your last screen. So if you pull that all the way over to the front screen, it should be like this. And all you're gonna have to do is redo that step for every app you want on your main screen. And it's as simple as that. After you're done doing that process, your home screen should look something like this. Last step you're gonna need to do is add your widgets. So you're gonna need to download one app and that's called Widget Smith. After you download the app, you're gonna wanna head over to your photos and choose which you want to be one of your widgets. And you're gonna to wanna to make that into an album. And just name it one so it's easy to remember. And then we're gonna swipe over and we're gonna type in widgets, open up the app, and you put a small widget, medium or large. And I'm gonna just pick medium. And you can look through, you don't have to make it a photo, you can pick a calendar, or whatever you want it to be, but I want mine to be a photo. So I'm gonna go down to where it says photo album. And after I do that, I'm gonna open it and I'm gonna click on the one I made, which is one. So I click on that and I'm gonna click save. And after I can back out, and I'm gonna go into my main screen and I'm gonna hold down like I'm deleting apps and then I'm gonna click and then I'm gonna click that plus button at the top of the screen. You're gonna scroll down and you're gonna click on which widget you picked. I picked medium, so that's what I'm gonna click. And you just click it and then after that it'll pop up on there and you can move it however you want. It can be on the top or the bottom. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and it helped you guys out. Please hit the like and the subscribe button for me. Thank you.